Bon dia! Good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in this beautiful world, whenever you're watching this YouTube video. For the newcomers, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. And my name is Didi Taihutu. And yes, I am the guy that four years ago with his family sold literally everything they own, went all into Bitcoin and started traveling the world. Coming to you now from the windy Lagos. Hopefully the wind is not too disturbing for today's video. In today's video, talking about the Bitcoin chart again, of course, because what are we going to do? Are we going to go to 40K or are we going to go to 30K or even 25K? I will give you an answer in today's video, talking about the family and about the blockchain news I already read this morning during my delicious cup of coffee in Lagos, Portugal. And I just ended a really cool interview with TRT London, which is a huge London television show where I talked about Bitcoin and why I think it's the next step in the evolution of money. Enjoy today's video, guys. Bam! Let's first start with the Bitcoin TA part, the part where I bomb you with really cool Bitcoin charts. This part, BAM! Let me know down below in the comments if there is too much wind guys, because I'm filming with the DJI, I thought it was not windy, but it's really windy today. And um, also let me down below in the comments before we start, do you like this new rhythm of showing you the videos in the morning at 6 during your delicious cup of coffee? Or are you like, Diddy, I don't give a fuck, I just want to see the videos, whatever time it is, I will always watch. Bam! Let's first start with the Bitcoin chart, the 4 hour chart, this one. Bam! On this 4 hour chart, you can see that Bitcoin is moving inside a pennant. This is a very important moment. Today or tomorrow, we will break out out of this a pennant. Already like a few hours ago, we could see Bitcoin dropping to the bottom of this pennant. To the bottom support line coming up this green one bitcoin exactly dropped to that bottom line now again moving upwards to the, towards 35,000 us dollar per bitcoin but the top is around 36,000 us dollar the top of the pennant i'm referring now and if we can break that one and break to the upside when we break out of this pennant then I can see us going back to 40k and maybe even to 44k as we can see the width of the start of the pennant it's almost 10k so 36 maybe even to 46k but if you could break downwards out of this pennant we could also easily drop with 10k all the way back to 25k so please be aware a pennant means we can break to the upside but also the downside yes I know I already said this in yesterday's video but it is just very important to realize and we can move both ways we will start to trade the move when we get a confirmation of the breakout direction will we break to the top we will go long will we break downwards to the bottom then we will go short on bitcoin keep you up to date bam talking about charts guys let's take a look at the bitcoin family chart this one bam on the family chart you can see we have been making an upwards movement already for weeks we are now around 30 dollar cents per family token 30 dollar cents we started at below 10 dollar cents so you already went times three in the last two months and yes of course this also has to do with ethereum going up but can you imagine that ethereum will break its all-time high and double from there just like bitcoin did that will of course have a very positive influence on the family token as well I'm not a financial advisor and I cannot give you the advice to buy family tokens, whatever, if you want to buy them so you belong to the huge Bitcoin family on the Discord server where you can you know, use all the advantages of owning a family token, you should do it. I don't do it because you can think you can make huge kind of profits out of it because that is not what the Bitcoin family is about. We do want to make profits but we want to share those profits all over the world with poor people we meet. Really cool information about the family token and yes, we just surpassed the 200k market cap level so give me some thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up thumbs up for the 200k market cap we just broke bam zoom out on the charts to see the weekly chart because we are still fighting 
this midline of the logarithmic growth curve and this midline is around 36k like i've already been seeing two weeks in a row sorry for all the noise of the cars but i'm like walking on the struts i'm walking on the streets towards a goal i am going for but the midline we have been already fighting this midline now for two weeks and if we repeat history we will keep fighting this line a couple of more weeks maybe before we break that line after a pullback to the 21 ma on this weekly chart we don't know maybe this year is different maybe all the institutional investors are buying a shitload of bitcoins which will withhold bitcoin from falling to this 21 moving average but let's see i look at the day charts and the week charts so i keep a broad perspective on what could happen to the bitcoin price while it's so windy here in portugal la gorge bam there were all the charts for the day guys let's jump into the blockchain news part the part where i talk to you about the news i read this morning during my coffee this part bam next article i read was about thailand and you guys you know i love thailand but this news i didn't like about thailand I need to watch when I'm walking, there's a lot of water, it rained because the Thai stock exchange doesn't want to list Bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency. And they have two reasons for this. The first reason is that they don't see that Bitcoin has any value beneath the whole Bitcoin blockchain. They don't see value in Bitcoin. I don't know how they can see value in gold. For me the same. But this Thai stock exchange, is, that is the first reason. And the second reason is that it needs to benefit the society. So that is like a really bullshit reason because if every production company that is now listed on the Thai stock exchange is like being beneficial for the environment, you know, that makes me laugh. That makes my ass laugh. Because why? Because most production companies are not doing good for the social environment of Thailand. They have waste. They have smoke out of their huge chimneys and all that stuff that this industrial production companies have. So I think two bullshit reasons, but I don't understand why the Thai stock exchange is doing this. But luckily in Thailand, you have BitCoop and BitCoop is like, I think 97% of all Bitcoin volume is created on the BitCoop exchange. So also Thai people have access to Bitcoin but they can't do it through the official Thai stock exchange, but they can use BitCup. BitCup, I will put a link down below. It's not an affiliate link, but it's at least a link that you, when you live in Thailand, can access Bitcoin and a very beautiful, good working exchange that I also used when I was in Thailand, of course. Bam! And yesterday, guys, we talked about that, like, uh, uh, Bitstamp was now doing all the KYC and then I told you guys yeah you know that is why decentralized exchanges will be growing tremendously in the next couple of years there is another one that has grown tremendously since they went live two months ago this one is called perpetual protocol it is a second layer application on the ethereum blockchain using a xdai scaling solution to be a dex on the ethereum blockchain they have grown tremendously in two months time to the sixth biggest decentralized exchange i think these decentralized exchanges are going to massively grow in 2021 as all the kyc and regulations will be like hunting all those exchanges that we use at the moment that is why I use Bybit, that is why I use Dudex, that is why I use PrimeXBT. They all don't have these regulations. They all don't have the KYC. So if you want to sign up to an exchange to buy Bitcoin or sell Bitcoin or exchange Bitcoin, then use Bybit, use Dudex or use Prime XBT. I bet at the moment till the 5th of February you get a $600 deposit bonus. Durex has a $300 deposit bonus and Prime XBT a 50% deposit bonus. Use the links down below the video if you want to sign up because I use those fee to fund a fund <laughs> that helps poor people all over the world. So please use the referral links, get your $600. Also, if you already used my link to buy bit like a couple of weeks or months ago, you can still claim these extra bonuses. You need to claim the rewards in the reward system on Bybit and use the claim word jackpot. Check it out, check down below in the description. There you see how you can claim $600 worth of bonuses now in Bybit. Bam! The last part of news that I want to talk to you guys about is about BMW and Ford. BMW and Ford are now using the blockchain 
to create birth certificates for the cars, which means every car that, that comes out of one of these huge companies will get a birth certificate on the blockchain. And from that moment, everything that happens to that car will be posted on that birth certificate on the blockchain. So you exactly know when you buy a second hand car, what the car went through in the previous year and the previous owners. You will see the previous owners, you will see the maintenance, you will see everything that happened to the car on the blockchain, very trustworthy, so you know that the car is official and that it was not like played with the numbers, the kilometers or whatever, the miles, however you call it in your country, but that is what blockchain is doing. Now also BMW and Ford joining the force of blockchain. Bam! And the last but not least news guys is that the amount of Bitcoin notes reached a new all-time high. We have 11,558 Bitcoin notes live and working at the moment. A new all-time high for the notes means new all-time high in decentralization of the Bitcoin network, which of course is completely positive because that is what Bitcoin needs to do, needs to decentralize. So many nodes running that we are unstoppable. And that is exactly what makes it possible for us to be your own bank, your own Bitcoin bank, to be very clear. And that is why I'm driving around with this car to show people all over the world that they need to be their own bank. And by decentralizing this, by creating more and more nodes all over the world, creating new all-time highs in the amount of nodes, we as a huge family become the Bitcoin family. And we as the Bitcoin family will change the world. Even better, we are already changing the world and we are going to change the world even more in the next couple of years. That was everything I wanted to share with you guys for today. I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, share it with your friends and family, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment as I love to respond to your comments. Always remember to zoom out in Bitcoin and to zoom in that life. Try to enjoy every single minute of the day and that is exactly what life should be about. Thanks for watching today and hopefully see you tomorrow again with better weather conditions, without the wind and without the clouds, but with beautiful sun on my face. Bam!